how to count your safe days. So here video leo, it's about counting your safe days. That's if you don't want to get pregnant and you also don't want to use any contraceptive method, whether it's the male condom, whether it's the female condom, whether it's the IUD, whether you don't want the three months injection or you don't want the implant, whether it's the three years implant or the five years implant or kama pia hautaki kutumia nini, kama hautaki kutumia pills. So this video today is about counting your safe days, all right? But remember, as much as you count your safe days, all right, you are supposed to be protected in terms of a sexually transmitted infections so that aside let us learn how to count our safe days that's if you don't want to use any contraceptive method right and we're going to do that with the help of an app squeezy kuna app mingi zenye zina kusaidia ku count days so you necessarily do not need uh what your calendar and all that so you basically just need to know your days know your cycle all right alafu you count your safe days so this video is about counting your safe days if you don't want to use any contraceptive method and you don't want to be pregnant. I decided to do this video today because yesterday, that's uh, 24th of uh, September 2024, was my last day of period. So that's why I decided to do this video today, how to count your safe day. And today is uh, 25th of September. So basically what you want to do after you've uh, installed this particular app, you just need to key in your day. So, unaenda hapa kwa settings. Alafu, as you can see, I hope you can see that. So, we have five days. Let me just uh, show you clearly. Yeah. So, unona hapa. So, uh, normally, mi uenda period zangu for five days. And my, my cycle is uh, 27 days. So, basically, cycle yangu, mine is normal. Ni ile, let me say normal in quotes, all right? So after you've keyed in, for example, come away when the period for seven days, come on end up for five days, come on end up for three days, you just key in, then the calendar, it aks idea ku, jua, your cycle, all right? Then after that, we go where? Hapa malipa meandikwa, calendar. As I said, I'm doing, I'm doing this video today, kwa sababu, yesterday was my last day of period, and today, yeah, like, uh, so one, two, three, four, five, nilimaliza period jana, Na leo, um, naendelea tu na cycle yangu, as you can see that, alright? So what you need to do after you've keyed in your details vizuri, uh, just check. So as I click here, 20th of September, that was on Friday. As I click here, unaona haujandikiwa anything hapa, okay? So uh, it shows you that iyo nitemenye, una have period zako, alright? Then to still nothing is written here, sorry. Nothing is three, nothing is written here, nothing is written here, nothing is written here. All right, in terms of kuandikiwa hapa, whether you have ch high chances of getting pregnant or low chances of getting pregnant or medium chances of getting pregnant, all right? So even do account save the zako. So the moment I click here, you see, nimeandikiwa low chances of getting pregnant, okay? Because it's my first day after my period but when you count you need to count your cycle for you to know your cycle you need to count from the first day time in unanza period all right yeah hapa here you can see it may equal one hapa pa may equal it's 20th yes but it may equal one two then three four five so basically this zako then you have period now when I click here, as I had clicked earlier on, Apple, low chances of getting pregnant, that is day six, all right, in your menstrual cycle. Day seven of your menstrual cycle, day eight of your menstrual cycle. The moment unafika, day nine of your menstrual cycle, all right, unona day seven, but we may low chances of getting pregnant, all right, but day nine of, um, of your menstrual cycle, you can see that it's written, it's, you've now, you're now in your fertility window, all right? Your fertility window. That is the, the ninth day in your menstrual cycle, all right? That is the ninth day in your menstrual cycle. Remember, Vletu Mesema, you count from the first day, Unanza period, Kuendelea Ivo. So, the ninth day of your menstrual cycle is your fertility window. Now, we go to October, okay? Still, the, that was, yeah, sorry, the ninth day, 
the 10th day bado umeandikiwa fertility window the 11th day when i say 11th you look up you look up here yeah so you see there is 11 here so when you go to october first october still high chances of getting pregnant you see that high chances of getting pregnant kwa nini high chances of getting pregnant because unakaribia your ovulation day like this calendar inakwambia hadi time yako ya ovulation which is high chance of getting pregnant hapo if you, if you want to have uh ama if you want to get pregnant then this is the best day to do what to have unprotected sex okay during your fertility window okay so kwa fertility window as you, you saw here it was written medium chance when you went to the 10th day medium chance 11th day medium chance 12th day high chances okay i hope you can see that yeah high chances ukienda 13th day high chances so ovulation happens on the 14th day all right on the 14th day of your menstrual cycle and the fertility window begins on the 9th day of your menstrual cycle when you say menstrual cycle una count from the first day ulianza period okay una count from the first day ulianza period all right yeah so uh the 14th day that's when you ovulate if you don't want to get pregnant please do not try do not try having unprotected sex on the 14th day 15th day as you see it's still written medium chances of getting pregnant remember during the ovulation day it was high chance of getting pregnant 15th day medium chance of getting pregnant 16th day medium chance of getting pregnant 17th medium 18th a uh, medium 19th that way the ah, yeah. ikifika sasa 20th or the 21st all right upper 20th or the 21st first inaanza kukua low chance of getting pregnant so 20th that's because unakaribia uh period zako hapa kwa ovulation it's high chance kwa sababu you've released an egg as a woman okay you've released an egg na egg yako inakuwa fertile for up to 24 hours but ya mwanaume inakuwa fertile for up to 7 days okay you've understood that and that's why hapa unaambiwa high chance hapa unaambiwa medium chance hapa bado unaambiwa medium chance because for example if you had unprotected sex here time of ovulation chances za hiyo sperm kukua bado active ziko high as we said up to 7 days so for example 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 unaona ikifika 7 when the sperms zinakuwa less active umeandikiwa low chances of getting pregnant all right so 21 still low chance kwa sababu unaenda ukikaribia period zako all right i hope this is helpful so low chance of getting pregnant sorry so low chance of getting pregnant basically that's how you count your safe days During the ovulation do not try having unprotected sex okay or rather during from the 9th day to the 15th day of your menstrual cycle that is your fertility window and therefore do not try having unprotected sex unless you want to get pregnant yeah so basically that's how you count your safe days but remember as much as you're counting your safe days you need to protect yourself against sexually transmitted infections like uh, hiv syphilis gonorrhea among other sexually transmitted infections all right so in summary what you need to do is to key in your days if you for example for me i go for my periods for up to 5 days all right so you count from day 1 to day 5 just key in 5 all right then the uh, the calendar or the app will just help you in determining your your cycle whether it's a uh, 21 whether it's a um, 28 whether it's 35 all right it will just assist you all right then from there you now need to track your calendar all right as we said on the ovulation day that's when you are not supposed to have unprotected sex or unprotected sexual intercourse because you're going to get pregnant but if you want to get pregnant then during your fertility window that's the best time or the best day to do what to have unprotected sex so basically that's for people who don't want to use any contraceptive whether you don't want to use any of the contraceptive method that i mentioned or more all right 
so basically that's it and that's how you count your safe days please share this video so that we are helping someone else whether it's a woman or a man just trying to help their woman or their girlfriend or their wife track their period calendar or rather track their menstrual cycle whether they are trying to have a baby or not trying to have a baby all right so thank you so much for watching please comment like and share this video so that we are informing as many people as possible thanks for watching